I am alive and it's good to be alive and oh my gosh, I haven't said that in forever. I think it's been about a week. It has been a week, hasn't it? Oh my goodness. I've been away for too long. Yes, I am still alive. I'm not dead, everyone. Uh, basically, after the bad news that I received that I was not going to become a partnered Warframe YouTuber anytime soon, I just sort of took a step back, kind of relaxed for a little while, you know, had some fresh air, uh, spent just a ton of time with friends and family, and, uh, just really spending more time with my wife and stuff, you know, not worrying about that, oh, every day when I come home, I gotta spend like two hours to make a video, you know, just... Spending more time having fun and just relaxing. It's been kind of nice, but at the same time, uh, I got a hospital bill and it was drastically more expensive than I wanted it to be. So I've been working a shit ton of overtime trying to help pay that off. Uh, I don't know how doctors sleep at night. I guess I'll just say rich and comfortably. Now, all joking aside, uh, this is going to be an update video on my channel to let you guys know that Planes of Eidolon is releasing for console players on Tuesday. That's in just a few days. So get ready for a ton of content. I am so excited. I've been feeling a little burnt out on Warframe lately just because, oh man, I, I couldn't help it. We are so close to the Planes of Eidolon release that I've just, my levels of hype for it have been so high that I'm like, I don't even want to play Warframe because I know that when PoE does come out, I'm just going to play the shit out of Warframe and nothing else. So I've been kind of trying to take a break from Warframe so I don't feel burnt out already when Planes comes out. So if anything, it's going to be, it's going to be so much fun. I haven't played enough Warframe lately. I'm really looking to scratch that itch. Also, the other exciting thing that I wanted to share with you guys is that I may or may not, we'll see what happens, but I may try to turn this into a Monster Hunter World and Warframe channel. Uh, I don't know how in the world I would do that. Again, this is just a maybe. The reason I had this idea is because given the fact that I'm not going to become a partnered Warframe YouTuber anytime soon, uh, I don't have to do only Warframe videos. Like, I would like to do mostly Warframe videos. That'll always be the bulk of my content, but... The only video game franchise to capture me as much as Warframe has would be Monster Hunter. And I haven't played a Monster Hunter game in like six years because they stopped supporting the platforms that I like to play on. They started going over to the Nintendo Wii and Wii U and all that stuff. And I was like, I don't own one of those, so I can't play Monster Hunter anymore. Awesome. Great. But Monster Hunter World looks absolutely amazing. I'm very excited for that. And I, I think maybe, I don't know, maybe that would be really fun really fun to cover for you guys. I used to be just a Monster Hunter expert, and I would pump hundreds of hours into that game. So basically what I'm doing right now is I'm literally, this is going to sound silly, I'm just fashion framing and getting ready for, uh, I'm just picking out what I want to use in the planes. What I'm going to use when I step out there for the first time. Ah, and get a breath of that sweet fresh air and the smell of dead grenier because I'm going to be slaughtering them by the millions, I promise you. But yeah, I went ahead and I decided to go with Ash just because, daggum, the boy always looks so freaking good. Look at him. What a sexy beast. Also because I just Ash is one of my mains. He's I just I love him. He's very familiar to me. I don't really have to think too much when playing as him. Uh, I'm interested to see how his seeking shurikens and his fatal teleport. Uh, and Blade Storm and things like that will function. Also, he can cloak for a good 10 seconds or so. So, really interested to see how that's going to play out. I am so pumped for this, you guys. This will be... I have almost as much excitement for this as you guys. Like, I have to learn this stuff the same as you do. It's going to be really fun exploring new content with you guys instead of explaining it to you guys. Uh, I'll still be doing a lot of that, like, with weapon reviews and stuff. But I'm just... This is going to be a whole new direction for my channel, and I just could not be more happy or excited. And I'm very sorry that I took, like, a whole week off, but uh, I think it helped me. I really needed it, if I'm being quite honest. I've been working myself to death at work this week, actually. I've been putting in uh, just too much overtime now. Um, but you know what? It, it's nice because it'll help me pay off this hospital bill, and once that's freed up, I'll have even more time to make videos for you guys. So let me know down in the comments section what you think. Are you guys excited to see my Planes of Eidolon content? And would you possibly be open to the idea of me making Monster Hunter World videos? Uh, I definitely would not be in the Monster Hunter flow as much as with Warframe. Like, I wouldn't just be the knower of everything, you know? It's not like, oh, I've played this for four years, so I, you know, listen to me. It would mostly just be little tips of what I've learned. It wouldn't be like 
I'm a grand master at monster hunting or anything. But uh, anyways, I'm I'm just I'm so giddy with excitement for you guys. There's only like four more days of waiting. So I love you guys. Thank you so much, by the way, for the continued support on the channel. Um, I haven't made a video in the last seven days, and people are still subscribing and leaving comments. And I'm still able to help you guys by replying to your comments and things like that. My God, look at that hideous. Uh, look at that hideous Halloween banshee. I was gonna make a Halloween f video for you guys, and Warframe just didn't have any Halloween content. But, uh, that's okay. I'm not blaming them. Like, I get that they're totally busy working on planes for consoles and stuff. I would, I would prefer that, honestly. I'm totally fine that there was no Halloween event this year. It's okay. Life goes on. I love you all to death, my awesome subscribers. I'm so excited to get back in the flow of making videos again. And, honestly, I, I'm just, I can't wait. What do you guys think of my... But planes of Eidolon. What gun should I use? You know what? Fuck it. If you guys think I should use specific gear in the planes, drop a comment down below. Tell me what Warframe or gun, primary, secondary, or melee you would like me to use. And that may uh, sway my opinion. And I'll give you a shout out in the video if I actually agree with what you say. Anyways, you guys, I'll just keep rambling forever. So I'll see you in the next video. Oh, look at my boy Cedric. He's on. Gotta go, peeps.